straight or you put weapons? Well, it so happened on my way to work this morning, I was stopped by a friendly Battle Creek police officer on Jackson Street who gave me a ticket that I was tracked on radar going 40 miles an hour in a 30 mile, 45 miles an hour in a 30 mile zone. I was rather disgusted, mad. I don't know what else I can say. Only thing I can think of is I'm trying to get even with you or keep up. What do you think about that? I don't know. I think we're going to have a lot of work to do yet to catch up with me. Without so we didn't take it way back before you start driving. Okay, I want you kids to get over here and each one of you to tell me what school means to you. Start out with Kevin. What does school mean to you, boy? School means to me a recess and... Recess. Recess. What's your name, honey? I need a K. I need a K what? A sister of Nene. Your sister of Nene. Do you go to school? Uh-huh. What school do you go to? I go to church. <laughs> oh, church school. You go to Second Baptist Church School. Let's find out what your sister do. What school do you attend? Lincoln School. Do you go to church school also? I have the Sunday School on Sunday. At where? At Second Baptist Church. Do you like this going to school on Sunday at Second Baptist Church? Uh-huh. I'll say, uh, I'll say yes. Yes, and Daddy, I like, I like when we play seeds in our room. Today we play a string beat. Miss Lark, I mean Miss Connor, she played some seeds. Okay, Nene, I think this is going to sound real good. What do you think, Nita? I found my dress. Okay, we're going to play it back. I think this is just about it right here. Okay? Goodbye. 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 Daddy, Daddy, can we call the picnic when it's real warm out with a picnic party? It's okay, that's a big deal. Just stop paying money. We'll talk about that later on. We've got Dara and Lennox and Ashley tonight. Okay, let's see. Hello, this is Kevin Davenport, Battle Creek, Michigan. Uh, yes, February the 10th, 1974. My dog had some puppies today. Uh, yesterday, she has ten. Ten. All of them are real dark, dark brown, all but one. And uh, uh, there's ten of them. They holler so much. Oh, and we have a, we have a dead bird hanging over the, uh, the, the doorway. And because it seemed like the snow was bad, he ran into it and cut his throat. We have with us Aunt May that's a visitor here. And later on, we're going to try to get her on this tape. She's shaking her head no, but we're going to let her get on the tape anyway. Okay, now I am going uh, to read a, read a poem to you. Uh, just a moment, let me find the page. Ow. I just the moment. Put that morning, morning. Susie Mona. This is the story of Susie Mona. It started one night and she sat by the fire. The fire was so hot, she jumped in a pot. The pot was so black, Susie dropped in a crack. The crack was so narrow, Susie climbed in a wheelbarrow. The wheelbarrow was so low, Susie fell in the snow. The snow was so white, Susie stayed there all night. The night was so long, this is the second page of Susie. The night was so long, Susie sang a song. The song was so sweet, Susie ran down the street. But, but oh, what a rider had Susie Mona. And I'm going to let Daddy get on here, and I'm going to let Aunt May say a few words. Oh, she's shaking her head to say no, but I'm going to let her say a few words anyway. Come on, Grandma. I'll hold it for you. Come on, hold it. Just say a few words. Yeah, you know how old it? What is your name? I'm the kid. How old are you? Two weeks. 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 Two
mother's name? Sinclair. What's your father's name? Sinclair. Who is your babysitter? Mrs. Curry. Who, who's your part-time babysitter? Daddy. Who, who's your third-ranking babysitter? Mommy. Who's that lady sitting on the couch behind you? Aunt Mary. Isn't that me your babysitter too? No. Nah. Yes. Yeah. What would you like to sing tonight? Thank you.